Um, can I ask you to introduce yourself, please? Um, my name is Alexandra, Alexandra Gut Ahmed. Um, I'm an honorary council general of Indian Krakow. Um, since I've got appointed some time ago, and recently I got the concurrence from the uh, government of Poland, today we have organized the event to inaugurate the uh, honorary consulate uh, here in Krakow. Uh, so, um, India until now has, obviously there's an embassy in Warsaw and until uh, recently there was the only one honorary council in Wrocław, Mr. Karteke Jori. Uh, I'm joining him now in this uh, prestigious uh, title of being honorary council as honorary council of India in Krakow. Um, so, my first uh, trip to India was as a student. I went to uh, Bangalore, where I was working with the University of Bangalore uh, as a student exchange. And later on, I went for the internship uh, with uh, a company um, in uh, Calcutta uh, called Kata. Uh, and there I've lived for three, four months. Uh, and. There I also met my husband, so I fell in love in India in two ways, in the country and in, in one of the people there. And uh, after uh, some time we got married and uh, we live here in Poland, but our ties with India are extremely strong. We travel very regularly. Um, we, are also are co we are also connected with India uh, on the business level. We work with India a lot. I think it's a uh, very complex uh, process and it's not one only thing that happens. Uh, there were many events when uh, uh, our engagement in some sort of assistance to Indian citizens in Krakow or, or, or tourists or uh, local Indians who live here um, probably has been noticed and appreciated. Uh, also, uh, the interaction with uh, uh, some of the uh, people who are here locally and who who were ready to cooperate with India, and we have built those connections. Um, and yes, eventually I've, I've been uh, offered such a prestigious and honorable uh, job. So um, I think that on one hand, you mentioned the community, uh, it's growing community, and I would love to see how this community gets more and more integrated with the Polish local community. So I, want, uh, um, I wouldn't like the, the, the Indian diaspora to, to grow and become stronger, but in a complete isolation from uh, uh, local communities here. So I really hope that we will be able to build bridges, connecting, uh, supporting each other, and also that helps to build understanding among people. And uh, I think it will be beneficial for both sides. Uh, on the other hand, obviously, there is a big requirement for uh, economic cooperation. After uh, uh, PM Modi's visit to Poland, uh, I see even more increased interest in, in uh, that kind of cooperation. I hope I can facilitate this as well. Uh, and also, uh, I hope that uh, my presence uh, representing India here in Krakow is also uh, going to help uh, to build awareness of India, of its culture, of its heritage, of its diversity among people uh, here in Krakow and uh, also Podkarpackie, Małopolskie and uh, uh, Świętokrzyskie. So I hope that I can reach out and make it um, uh, ever-growing and very uh, rich uh, kind of uh, relation between. I think the best way is to email me. Uh, I also have the uh, Facebook profile, a Honorowy Consul Indy uh, uh, w Krakowie, uh, or email at office at hcgi, which is Honorary Council General India, krakow.pl.